scores. Lindsay scores. And we've seen lots of this tonight. The Canucks all over the Jets. Doug Lindster snaps it by Bob Essenza. Essenza's first shot on net in this playoffs. And here's the shot off the post by Evgeny Davidoff. I helped turn the momentum of this game around. Davidoff steals, shoots, scores! Now you don't like the guy to dance too much when you score in a 6 nothing game, but Davidoff has been their best forward tonight for the Winnipeg Jets. By Darren Shannon. Shannon comes up with it. Here's Aaron Brockman wrapped around. He scores! Aaron Brockman and the Jets have two quick goals. I'm sure John Paddock likes this because it was all Canucks. They were playing with confidence, playing very cocky. Randy Carlisle has gone to the dressing room with a leg injury. Here's a pass for Parker moving in. Despite the five goals allowed in 27 shots on Sunday, Tabaracci has the third best save percentage in the playoffs. Turns at center. Nice move on Kron. Lost control. Hit by Walter, but Olison moves up. Here's Frederick Olison. Trying to get a shot away. It's rolled in front. They score! Keith Kachuk! And it's the Winnipeg Jets who get the first goal as Trevor Linden is talking it over with Keith Kachuk now at the face-off at center ice. Joining the play, and a good defensive play there by Plavsic. Here's Rodding with the breakaway. Cliff Rodding looking for his first goal. Rodding scores! Cliff Rodding finally has broken his drunk. Here's a former Blackhawk ready to take the face-off in his own zone. Captain Troy Murray with the Canucks control. Lavsic puts it in front. Murray has his man tied up. Murray shoots, scores! What a blast! And Vancouver has the lead. He's up against Ulanov. Broughton helped out, couldn't clear it. Adams back to Linden. Three shots, first period. There's a chance. Lister, Rodding scores! And Cliff Rodding is officially out of the slump now. Well, they scored. 32 seconds after the first goal of the game by the Jets, and now 34 seconds into the second period, it's rotting again. Dave Babbage, the former Winnipeg Jet defenseman, spent five and a half seasons here, and he has been a force in this series. Lume against Sykes, Linden helps out, back to Babbage. There's rotting loose, Cortnell's in front. Back it comes to Babbage. Wrist shot scores! Dave Babbage with the shot, it changed direction. Canucks lead 4-1. In they come, Canucks looking for more. Out in front, Tabaracci down. Sandlock the backhand. Here's a chance, shot score, Tom Fergus. <laughs> 35 seconds to go in the period. Olison again. God yelling to shoot. Here's a chance in front, they score! Pat Elnick on the redirection. Steen kicked it over to Kachuk, back to Newmanen. He flips it in, Lidster has it go off his glove. David up right on, Steen, Kachuk, scores! for the first time since the first period. Ulanov skated by it. Mameso has it. And Ulanov hands it away. Here's Bure. Scores! Ulanov handed it right to Bure, and he made no mistake. Look at Ulanov on his backhand. 
gets the puck and then just slides it. And there's Pavel Burry. Thank you very much. He waits for Tabaracci to collapse. You see Tabaracci start to go down. Olsen to Ulanov, and he's met by Sandlack. Jarring check, Nedved back in. Passes it across, Sandlack, Fergus scores! What a play, Jim Sandlack started it with a hit and set up Fergus for the goal. Nedved, Sandlack, and Fergus give them three weapons, and here's Bure looking for the hat trick. It scores! Three for Bure, and is there any doubt we're headed to Vancouver for game seven? And all that really counts is the Vancouver Canucks have won two in a row and are forcing this to a seventh game Thursday night in Vancouver with a thorough 8-3 victory. Hopefully that these last couple games are a big round booster for our team uh, yeah. mentally anyways. You know, it's, we were down three games to one and it's, uh, now it's just a one game series. It's a direct contrast to how we play all season. We, we play a lot tighter and a lot uh, better, smarter game than, than that. Uh, usually and uh, I don't know why we're making this. Fergus told me today the key to his line has been the play of Sandlack. Here's Babbitt walking in. Tabaracci stops. Fergus scores! Sergio Momesso has played a good physical series and look at Newman and he's not the strongest guy in the world by any stretch of the imagination. Obviously, the Jets want to throw Pavel Burry off his game. He's been playing well. Look at Keith Kachuk. Great Burry's face. Two Jets, and there's Burry's reaction. And no call by Kerry Fraser. His team has played pretty well. A lot better than they did in games five and six. A much more disciplined style. They can't put the puck past Kirk McLean. And Pat Quinn has to be pleased with the way his team has played. He knew it wasn't going to be an eight-goal game tonight. Lead pass for Nedved. Back in for Fergus. Tied up. Sandlack and a great club stop by Tabaracci. Clears off the boards and running will start back. Here's Hartman. Right wing feed. Linden with room. Scores! Over the past two years, when Trevor Linden has scored, the Canucks are 40 12. Classic skates forward. Cortnell should be the first man in. He was tied up by Brock. Comes back to the line. Lume. Shot. Deflected. Scores! Skating into the other corner to get it. To the point that passed Olison. Now Ronning steals. Has Cortnell with him. Ronning works in. Cortnell! Scores!
Jets have a future, a bright future in front of them. Players like Pete Kachuk and Jenny Davidoff and goaltender Rick Tavaracci. And the Vancouver Canucks celebrate their first playoff series victory in 10 years. Last time they won a playoff series, they went to the Stanley Cup final. You know, to be down 3-1, Everybody was pretty down uh, at the time, but uh, we regrouped and uh, everybody dug down and did what it took to uh, win three in a row. We were expected to win, and I think that was a little added pressure, and the guys came out a little tight, but uh, we just stuck to our system and, and just kept going on the things that we knew were going to make us successful. Think about the things we hadn't done well earlier on, and, uh, and it was a very good team effort the last three games. and. Uh, in what is obviously uh, a very scary situation, a one-game uh, setup, we were happy to be there, and uh, and our guys did a very good job.